Hi guys, it's Georgia here from The Vintage Vision. Welcome back to Video Job Beauty. So today's makeup tutorial is gonna be this look. It's my everyday winter makeup. It's a really pretty kind of glowy, sparkly makeup look for this time of year. So stay tuned if you wanna find out how to do it. So the first product I'm going to be using is MAC Strobe Cream. This is just going to moisturise my face and give my skin more of a dewy look. So I'm literally just going to put this um, along my cheekbones, run it down the middle of my nose and run it along my forehead. So next I'm going to be taking MAC Face and Body Foundation in the shade C1. This is a really light coverage foundation, we don't want the makeup to be too heavy because it is an everyday look. So this is the perfect kind of foundation for this look. So to apply this I'm just going to be taking my Real Techniques Expert Face Brush. This is um, a kind of perfect foundation brush. So along with the strobe cream this foundation is just going to give your face a really healthy glowy look. I'm just kind of applying it where there's any redness, so along my cheeks, under the eyes. So I'm just going to take it down slightly onto the neck as well, just so that there aren't any harsh lines around the chin area. So to conceal, I'm taking Barbara Daly's concealer in the shade medium. This is just um, a range that is in Tesco's, but it's amazing quality. Um, she is a makeup artist herself and their products are really affordable, so definitely recommend you trying them out. Apply this, I'm going to be taking my Real Techniques Deluxe Crease Brush. I'm just going to be taking that anywhere that the face needs concealing and just to cover up any redness on the skin. So next I'm going to be filling in my eyebrows. They don't need filling in too much, but I'm just going to um, kind of cover any sparse areas. So to do that I'm going to be taking my Real Techniques Brow Brush and I'm going to be using Max Charcoal Brown Eyeshadow just to fill them in. This is a really great brush for eyebrows because it is angular, so you can really create a good shape with the brows. So next we're going to go onto the eyes and first of all I'm going to take Benefit Stay Don't Stray Eye Primer. This is just so the base really stays onto the eyes and we don't get any creasing. So I'm just going to take a small pump of this onto my finger and just pat it onto my eyelids. Okay, so next I'm going to be using Maybelline's 24 hour colour tattoo in the shade On and On Bronze. This is a really gorgeous cream eyeshadow. It looks great on its own but you can also apply a shadow over the top. I'm just going to be using it on its own. It's a really gorgeous bronze colour and it's got like a hint of gold in it so it's perfect for winter. So I'm just going to be using my finger to apply this. So I'm then just going to take a blending brush and I'm just going to buff out those harsh lines. So I'm also going to take that cream eyeshadow just under my eyes as well. So I'm going to go back to the Real Techniques brow brush. Because this is angled, it's a really nice brush to use um, under your eyes as well with eyeshadow. So next I'm just going to be curling my eyelashes with some eyelash curlers. So for mascara, I'm going to be taking Maybelline's Rocket Volume Mascara. This is my new favourite mascara at the moment. It's really similar to the Benefit Their Real Mascara, just because it's really lengthening, really volumising, and it's like a quarter of the price. So next, I'm going to be um, using a cream blush from Bourjois in the shade 01. This is just a really gorgeous pinky peach shade, and it's really good for like a pretty girly makeup. So to apply this, I'm just going to be taking my Real Techniques buffing brush just because I think it buffs nicely onto the apples of the cheeks. Okay, so to top the whole look off, we're going to move on to lips and I'm going to be taking Kate Moss's um, matte lipsticks from Rimmel in the shade 107. I know that this is such a popular lipstick for autumn, winter time. Most people have it.
Okay guys, so this is the finished makeup look. I really hope you like it. I think it's a really pretty look for this time of year. Um, kind of neutral sparkly eyes with a pop of colour on the lips. It will kind of really make you stand out on like a dreary winter's day. Please be sure to hit the subscribe button if you haven't already. You can also subscribe to my channel, The Vintage Vision as well, if you'd like to, that would make me happy. And join me next week where I will be styling a skort in like three different ways. See you next week, guys. Bye.